Hey, it's Mr. D, the band teacher, back again for another quick performance video. It's for the flute. It's called The Simple Song by Ralph Gunther. And uh, it's a great level one solo, one of those first flute solos that, uh, you know, you should learn, get under your belt. It's a really wonderful solo. Um, when you get the song, it's usually in a, in a book, a um, flute solo book. Um, again, it's Ralph Gunther, and the publisher is Belwyn Mills. Um, take a look at the key signature. It is in the key of E flat. Um, you have some A flats. You have a couple of natural signs. Um, so it's a lot of fun. It's called the a simple song. It's definitely a level one beginner solo. So again, this is a performance video, and I am going to start after the piano introduction. So there's a four measure piano introduction. I'm going to start on the G. Okay. And it does say tempo uh, quarter note equals 126. I'm going to play it a little bit slower since this is probably the first time um, that you're hearing it or playing along with it. Um, the best way to use this video as a tool is, um, like I've said in my other videos, you want to get a set of headphones, um, plug them into your computer, and I guess unless you have loud speakers, um, and you want to play along with me. And be sure you know how to start and stop the video. So if you get to a point where you can't play it, stop the video and learn it on your own and then continue with me. I mean, it's great to watch me play and get a sense of what the song sounds like, but you really want to be sort of an active participant. Okay? So here we go with Ralph Gunther's A Simple Song, Flute Solo Level 1. <coughs> Next spot. Spot after thirty seven. Okay, so a simple song by Ralph Gunther. Um, just a couple of notes. I won't do a separate performance, uh, you know, lesson video on this. This is a pretty straightforward kind of song. Um, the A you're going to use is this one. It's the A flat with your pinky. Um, and on line three, there is an A natural. That one's fingered like this. Okay, so this is A flat, and that's A. A flat, and then A. Um, you know, I, when I perform this, I kind of skipped over the, the long rest. If you're performing this in a recital setting, you're going to need to make sure that you count the long rest correctly. And the way you would count it, like the first four measures, that four measure long rest, is one, two, three, two, two, three, three, two, three, four, two, three. Okay? And again, I did take the song a little bit slower. Um, I tried to do the crescendo to decrescendo at 13, where you're starting that pattern a little bit louder and kind of uh, diminishing down or getting softer. Um, and there's two ritardandos. There's one before 37. And the ritardando, you may or may not know, means to gradually get slower. So you're going to want to get slower in that section. Two measures before 37 sounds like this. And then there's what we call a tempo, which is a return to the tempo that you started with. And that begins at 37. At the end, too, you have the slight retardando, too. Okay, so keep that in mind as you prepare a simple song by Ralph Gunther. If you have any questions, go to the contact link at the website. In the meantime, rock on, keep practicing. 
um, simple song. It's a great song to learn as a flute player. And uh, we'll talk to you soon.